Hey, what's going on, everybody? Chad Gadir from Dash Flicks, and the day has finally come. Our brand new funnel builder, our brand new app called Funnels is out. It is in your dashboards right now. Go check it out. Go start building some amazing funnels. I was going to give you a quick two-minute demo to show you around the new app um, just to make sure that you're kind of getting started off on the right foot. First and foremost, if you've been using any other funnel builder platform, um, it's going to be very similar. Plus, we have some advanced features that are going to go along with it. I'm going to try to keep this demo short, even though we can do a lot. I'll be creating a bunch of other help docs and additional demo videos moving forward um, as we get closer uh, to launching more and more. And I'm going to be building funnels pretty much daily to have some fun with you guys. So uh, I'll be I'll be producing a lot of really awesome educational content on how to build funnels, the type of uh, funnels to build, um, how to make money using funnels and all of the above. But just for the sake of time here, you are going to see, once again, a brand new app inside of your dashboard. Right here, it's called Funnels. You just click on that app and you will probably get to a page that looks just like this, except you'll have no funnels in it. I'm just inside of a demo account, by the way, guys. So I don't have any funnels built in here. I'm just gonna play around um, and have some fun. But you'll just go right up here. You'll click brand new uh, uh, funnel, create new funnel. Call your funnel whatever you want. So let's just say I want to call it my first funnel, right? Um, if you don't have a domain name, you don't have to select one. Uh, if you do, you can hook up domain names from within settings. Uh, so if I actually just exit out of here. Um, one cool thing before we go into the builder, I'll show you this. Um, let's get this out of the way. So one cool thing is um, we have something that's called Lightning Domain. So every domain name you hook up inside um, of your funnels, we run it all through Cloudflare. So you're going to get the speed, the reliability, the security. You're going to get all the extra added benefits of Cloudflare. So go grab any domain name from any registrar that you have, and you just set it up in here. Okay, and we host it, and we do all that stuff for you for free. All right, so you just click New Domain, add your domain name in here, and get it all set up. All right, that's how you activate your funnel for your domain uh, or your domain for your funnel. Pretty simple. All right, now we're going to go over here. We're going to click New Funnels. I'll just drop that in here. Um, I'll select the domain name that I already have and I will click create first funnel and there it is my first funnel So I'm just gonna go in here and just like your ordinary funnel builders This is what you can expect. You can go in here and start adding pages, right? Let's just say I call this uh, webinar um, Whatever I'll just call it webinar VSL, right? And then I will call it um, You know webinar confirmation Page all right, let's just say we want to build a webinar confirmation page. Boom, there we go. We have all of my pages. If I go back to the first page, okay, let's just give you a quick tour. All right, first and foremost, um, every single page has funnel stats. So at the bottom of every single page, you'll see exactly what this funnel step is producing as far as unique visitors, opt-ins, orders, and sales, which is going to be really cool as you start progressing um, with setting a lot of traffic to your funnels. You're going to be able to see what it's actually producing, okay? You can also duplicate funnel steps, delete funnel steps. Um, every single funnel step also has its own settings, so you can just go in here, edit the details, the SEO, the tracking code, and the custom CSS for that specific funnel step. Also on top here, these are your global funnel settings. So if you go to here, you can see analytics for your entire funnel. You can see all of the contacts and the form submissions that are happening for every single one of your funnels. Uh, well, for this particular, uh, particular funnel. Um, you can see the sales that this funnel is producing. And you can also go to settings um, and manage all of the settings. Things like your funnel name, your funnel domain name, right? Select whatever domain name you want. This is really cool too. Um, if you want, you can turn this on and we automatically add the live chat to your website so you don't even need to code or copy and paste or do anything um, also global header and footer tracking favicon uh, and tags to help you kind of segment your funnels right that's it pretty simple overview now i'm going to go into the actual builder so i'll click edit and this is our brand new funnel builder so if i go in here um pretty similar once again to other funnel builders you have your sections your rows and your elements if you've ever built funnels you're gonna pretty much breeze through this there's really not uh, any learning curve but uh, let's just say i wanted to build an opt-in funnel right um, where i'm having somebody give me their name and email address in exchange for i don't know downloadable pdf or something like that so i'll just add a full width section um, i will add a two column row um, and i'll add uh, maybe i want to add you know my logo up top here uh, and uh, i want to add a button over here and all i got to do is just you know click and drag and drop and that's really how easy it is right so let's go over here upload my logo right let's click logo right boom logo and uh let's say i want to upload a png i want to upload the uh the white version of our logo so let's go over here bam we added in here 
Uh, I will go ahead and I'll make this section black. Um, so we go over here, background, right? Call it black. Cool, I'll go over here, make this a little bit smaller, but I wanna show you like the speed in which you can actually, let's just say I want this to, um, you know, open a pop-up, right? And I wanna add a new section and I wanna add a full width section. I'll go two columns here. Um, and maybe I'll have a video here that's kind of telling them what they're gonna learn when they opt in. Um, we'll get some bullets in here. Uh, and then I'll even add a form. What's really cool about this is the forms that you add are actually the forms inside of the form builder. So all the forms that you have inside of the form builder will automatically get in here. Um, I also did some styling to the form. So I gave it like white text and stuff like that. So what I'll do is I'll actually make this section have a black background uh, as well. Um, and that'll make it look really nice and sweet. Okay, cool. And I'll give this white text down here. But you can see, guys, this is like a super intuitive uh, funnel builder, um, which you can literally do anything. Let's just say I save that, right? Uh, I can also add pop-ups, right? So I'm not going to build the whole funnel during this demo, but you can see um, that it is very advanced and you can do a lot of really cool things. On top of that, instead of just um, uh, having opt-in forms and things like that, you can also sell stuff in the funnel. So um, we added a, a lot of really cool elements here. So let's add a, a one column. Um, let's get myself on this side. So we have a uh, checkout element. So we have one step checkout, two step checkout. We have order confirmations. And then one thing that we created, which we think is really cool, which is called one click upsell. And I'll explain to you what that is. But let's just say I want to do a two step checkout. Um, another thing that's super cool is once you have your Stripe account integrated into Dash Clicks, all your products and everything will show up in billing. Plus it's fully integrated inside of your funnel builder. So as people are purchasing, it's automatically integrated with Stripe. Any recurring subscriptions will automatically be there. You'll see all inside of your billing app. You'll see all of the orders in your funnels app. It's just one sweet place. You don't have to log in to anywhere. You don't have to like manually add products like you might do in like ClickFunnels or other funnel builders, right? Let's just say I wanted to add, I don't know, whatever. I'm just gonna add any dummy product that I have in here. Uh, let's just say I wanna add SEO Platinum for whatever reason, right? Bam, there's my two-step checkout page uh, and I can fully customize it, right? I can do a one-step checkout page. Also, what I can do um, is I can do what we call a one-click upsell. So I would literally do the same thing and this is a button where if you would add it after the page, right? So somebody would buy something from you and then on the very next page, you can have a one-click upsell where you, if the, the user just clicks on the button, you can automatically restore the card, restore all the information in your Stripe account. They don't need to input their credit card or anything. This will increase your conversion rates like crazy. We use it inside of our funnels that we have right now. But all you have to do is literally just click on this. Uh, user has to click on this and we charge a credit card on file, take them over to the next page or whatever button action you set here. So that is an awesome feature that we have as well, um, which is the one click upsell feature. So a lot of really cool things also inside of the funnel builder. You can navigate between pages. Um, you can also customize what it looks like on mobile. Uh, you can set things for mobile specific. So if I go here and I go to settings um, and I want to go to mobile only, right? So that will only show up on mobile, right? So once again, lots of really powerful features here inside of the funnel builder. Um, also, we also have order bumps as well. So if you add, let's say, let's say a one step checkout, right? And we call it SEO, right? Let's just drag that in there, right? Boom, there's my one step checkout. If I go to the settings, you can also add order bumps in here too, right? So let's just say I want to add whatever this is, right? You know, DC annual, right? Forget about the spelling. I'll just add whatever I want, but you guys get the gist. You can add order bumps in here. So like if you are currently using a funnel builder, you can do everything that you can inside of the Dashlex funnel builder so you can get away from paying all of those extra added fees that you're already paying outside of Dashlex and start building all of your funnels inside of Dashlex. Also, some questions that you're probably going to have, I'll knock them out for you right, uh, right here right now. Can you import from other funnel builders? In the next one to two months, we will be releasing importer features for ClickFunnels and GHL. So if you currently have existing funnels, we'll be able to migrate and import those funnels into Dashlix and you can just use Dashlix for those. Also, you're probably asking, are we gonna have any templates that are gonna be coming out? So what we're actually gonna be doing is all of the templates that we have inside of Instasites, we're gonna start with the landing page templates here. So that there's 101 two-page uh, opt-in templates across every single niche. We're gonna basically be loading all of those templates inside of the funnel builder. So in the next couple of weeks, we'll start releasing templates and every couple of weeks, 
we're gonna be pushing new templates um, over to you a lot of also amazing stuff to come as far as hooking up Zapier with your funnels um, and doing a lot of just more advanced things inside of the funnel builder um, super excited to bring this feature to you we're rolling this out as an alpha version so hopefully by the end of this week if we find any small bugs or anything like that that are in the platform we request also please if you can send us your feedback it really will help us and, and help our development team move faster we're gonna be pushing changes live every single day um, super excited for this feature super excited for you to use it go build your first funnel and tell me how you love it and i'll see you on the inside have a good one